Yo, look at these graphics. Maybe this is not in the Lemmings universe. No, I was thinking of just Lomax. Oh, you can even pick up enemies and just chuck them. So you can jump on enemies and you can also, like, throw them at other enemies. Alright, let's go to options. Oh, you can change... You can change your continues? Look, I don't want practice mode. What are my controls? Okay, you know what? The default controls are good. B being jump, A to be action, and C to cast a spell. Alright, let's just jump right in. Oh, isometric world map. Look at these clouds, they're just... They're wavy. It's just like a pulsating gelatinous mass. Oh, I guess I'll just start right here. Try not to get impaled on that post. Okay, when you pause, it just goes like this. Okay, I can read a scroll. I don't have any scrolls. Oh, I can create spells? I guess I need to get items for that first. Treasure. I need to go get that. Okay, so trampolines work where you just like have to hit the jump button when you're on them. Okay, that's how you open the chest. I think that went to my magic file. Look at how angry he is. Oh, oh! Okay, good, there was something down there. I'm dead. <laughs> they put a platform there! That's just... there for the sake of you dying when you walk on it. Wait, what if I just hold the jump button? Okay, that's actually a better way to handle the trampolines. Man, I didn't think bots like Flink that much. I mean, it's a really good game. Oh my goodness. Am I gonna game over already? Okay, well, I'm only on the first stage, so you know what? Let's just say no. I'll just go into the darkness. Alright, so that's it for Flink! <laughs> I'm just kidding, we're, we're... I had a bad start, so I just needed to de-rust. Alright, are the options the same? Okay, they are. Maybe you get more for your magic meter whenever you kill enemies. Yeah, I think that's what fills it up. Oh, what do the feathers do? Oh, I can just... Maybe I can create a potion with this. Do I need, like, three items? Can I create them with two? I guess you have to have three catalysts.
Oh. Well, I got an idea how I'm gonna get up there. Oh! No! Come back! Oh, there's no way to get up there, is it? Unless... Oh, one up! Oh! Shit! So whenever you get hit, you'll lose your items and you have to pick them up again. What the hell is this? like little rock aliens. Oh, I still have only like one magic leaf and one eagle's feather. I thought I had other items. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Hey, Cage R JRPG fanatic. Good to see you. Oh, nice. I had to, like, hold down and hit A to pick that up. How the hell am I gonna get up there? Oh! One of the leaves appeared! Another one up! Hey there, Amiga Kami. Good to see you. Jump. Just finished my Let's Play on Sword of Mana? Oh, nice. It was alright. It was probably not the best mana game I played. But it was serviceable. I get you. No, you won't. Information. Use the action button to hang on ropes. Push up or down to climb. Press jump to leave the rope again. Okay. And I just chuck it in the water. <laughs> You don't jump very high. Just want to see if there's any secrets. Oh, that better be a tail. Oh, it's in pain. Look at the monkey. It hurts. Oh, that looks so wrong. Aha! Okay, so there's some neat little puzzle-solving elements. Like, using a seesaw. Oh, can I pan the camera? Oh, you can pick up treasure chests, too! You can just pick up the entire chest! Or just smash that fire-breathing totem. Can I still create a spell yet? No, I still can't. Damn. What if I can just like... Oh! I think I was gonna wake up! So they do recover even when you're grabbing them? Oh god.
I nearly jumped through the platform. There we go. Ah! Come on! I thought there'd be something down there! No, it turns out it was just death! Hey, look, all my magic's gone. Man, you get punished so freaking hard whenever you die. And I think it's like that down there, too. Do I still have my catalyst items? Or are they gone? Okay, no, I still have them. Do I speak French? I learned French in high school, but I didn't learn a lot of it. What's this? You are able to slide down 45 degree hills by pressing down on the joypad. This way you're also able to slide tackle enemies, which is very effective. I feel like you should have put that chest before the slide, not after. Just saying. What other languages do I speak? Uh, none of them. A gold ring. Alright, what if I take these three and combine them? Oh, give me a lemming! And I just boot it? Why am I doing this? I don't think that did a spell for me. So now the items are gone. Oh man. So I'll definitely have to be on the lookout for some spell recipes. Okay, you can only pick up treasure chests when they're empty. Oh, withered leaves will fall as soon as you land on them. I think that might have been our first scroll. Quick grow. To create the quick grow spell, you'll need a feather, a leaf, and a silver ring. I know that the feather is the one in the middle. Oh, so that's not only you need the correct catalyst items, but you have to put them in the specific order. So if I had the, like, leaf feather ring, it may not create quick grow, but ring feather leaf could. Oh, look at the effect on the water. He might have what I need. No! Why is... How the frick are you supposed to even fight this guy? It just goes away from you. Read magic scrolls very carefully before you create a spell. Don't waste your ingredients. I, I'm too late on that one. When you hit it once, it just... It's too fast. No, oh, I want to go back, see if I can respawn that- uh-oh. We have an auto-scroller. Oh god. You got giant water serpents. Seems they try to go to your current position. 
So you can just bait them far away from where you need to go. Look at the scale. How did that hit me? That should not have hit me. What is this? Once a treasure chest is empty, you can pick it up and throw it against other enemies. Yeah, I know. Might as well just grab it now. Oh. Oh, but well, my jumping is garbage. I can't even reach the bottom platform. Yeah. Even if treasure chests are empty, they're still very heavy. Who'd have thunk it? <laughs> There, I actually got the jump on that enemy. So I think as long as I have some magic in the vial, I'm able to take hits. But once that vial is empty, one hit will kill me. When using the quick grow spell, you have to stand on the actual plant that you want to grow. Okay, so I can do it on that, but I... I don't have it. Oh, watch out for the grabby hands! Okay, well that has a checkpoint at least. Am I supposed to stand on it when its hand is open? Okay, yes, you are. Just gotta watch its pattern carefully. Oh. Oh, I really don't like this. Oh, it got away! That's the part I hate, like... The, the catalyst, they get a... The catalyst thieves... They just go off-screen and you hit them once, they're too fast for you. So I think you have to use the rock on him. There we go. Hmm. Why do I have this feeling I need more than one rock? Let me just throw the rest of them up here. It's very ambitious for its own good, let's let's be real. Yeah, I, I did need another rock. Alright, that's the end of the level. Oh, you can go back to previous levels. So I wonder if, like, I could get, like, a good item if I have the Quick Grow spell learned, and then go back. So there might be some backtracking that's encouraged. I can probably jump on this enemy, can I? Oh, I can! Oh, there's nothing up there, okay. Hey there, Ash. Oh, killing that enemy created another one. Or another treasure chest. So we might be encouraged to try to kill all the enemies we see.
Maybe the rock would be better to use. Oh! No! Oh, it takes away all! All! Of your magic if you hit even once! It really borrowed that from Sonic. Like, where a single hit just takes away all your extra collectibles. I understand, like, trying to take one of them, but all of them? That's a bit mean. So it's always a good idea to try to get more of these little orbs. Oh, I threw it the wrong way. Oh, you can only hit it on the head. Oh, damn it! Oh, and they don't come to you, either. There's a bit of a difficulty curve, but it's not unreasonable, at least. Oh, at the worst possible time that Piranha shows up. Wait, I, I can probably create the spell now. Wait, should I? You see, I have like two of these. So if I get it wrong, I could just try it again. But I only have one silver ring. Maybe I need another scroll before I try for Quick Grow. Because I don't know what goes on the left side. Is it the ring or the uh, leaf? I imagine you could probably look it up online. But where's the fun in that? Volume 16 on Chainsaw Man and Night Bitch. Really? They actually called it Night Bitch? Oh, those rock monsters breathe fire. Hang on. Okay, good. I made it. Oh, no! I did not make that one. That chest might be hard to get. Maybe I should just not bother for it. Ooh, I'm almost at the, uh, village. Use keys to open locked treasure chests, but use them wisely. Oh, some of them are locked? I was wondering what that key I got earlier was for. How do you use the key? Oh, that's a spell? You know, I feel like that wasn't worth it. Oh, 
Oh, now I can't pick up that rock again. Wait, what if I hold the A button? Okay, he'll just automatically grab it. That's helpful to know. Oh, that time he didn't do it. Maybe you have to like hit the action button when you're ready when you're actually just jumping. Oh, I only have one key though. And I used it. So I might have gotten better shit over there. Oh, that's so satisfying. Please don't come down here. Okay. Okay, that works. Wait, could I go to the right down there? I might want to go over here first. Yeah, I think I'm supposed to go down there? No? Wait. Maybe I gotta go higher up? No. Maybe I'm supposed to go down. Yeah, this could all be for optional crap. Oh, I don't like where this is going, though. Maybe I'm supposed to go left? I don't know how I'm going to make it back without touching the spikes. I thought this is where you had to go. Yeah, look at that! What was I supposed to do there? I don't know, chat. I feel like this part was not thought out through. Oh, there was another chest! Oh man, those platforms are gone now. Wait, maybe I can go back this way. Yeah, that works. There's another one. Oh, okay, no, that just sent me back to the beginning. Yeah, but if I go down there, I'm gonna die. But wait, where am I supposed to go? I don't know. I, I looked everywhere.
Yeah, you don't go over there. Can I just throw a rock at lock treasure chest? No? Not over there. Okay, I'm kind of confused, and I really shouldn't be, but I am. Yeah, you think you're supposed to go in here. Like, this looks suspiciously... Like an exit. What? There's a fake floor? Did I... Oh, now I, I don't fall down there. But one time I did. Pressing up? No, I... When you press up, it just does this. I'm just bobbling my head. Like an absolute clown. And usually to transition to the next area, you just walk to the edge of the screen and it works. Here it doesn't. Oh, what? I was hitting up many times! Now it works! What the fuck? Next time, complete it the first time! Oh. Well, I guess I can't get to that magic leaf now. Oh wow, I can just walk underwater. I don't... I don't seem to have an air meter. Oh my god, it turned around on a dime. Oh, these trees spit rocks. So I have to watch out for that. Yeah, it didn't seem to work the first time, but now it does, but it would work. At least we're through. Oh god, that was close. That's the end of the stage. End? Wait, is there gonna be a boss? How many silver rings do I have? I have two. Alright, let's try ring, feather, leaf. Hey! Stop pulling my leg! Alright, leaf, feather, ring. Okay, that's our new spell. So whenever we find one of those leaves, we can actually use it. Oh. Like right here. When a leader is released, then listen carefully to what he tells you. You will only say it once. Hey there, Tony. Do I have to stand on the leaf? Aha! That's 
how you get to the chest. What exactly is a leader, though? Oh! Oh, shit! Oh, was that my own rock that hit me? Look at the size of this thing! Maybe I could just jump on its head. No, I think the trick here is I have to use this rock. Okay, so I think when it finishes its jump, is when I gotta throw the rock. Because then its head is low enough. Okay, that's what I have to do. Look at it, how animated it is! Holy shit! And this is on a Genesis! Not dead yet. Okay, well, I have to really take my time with this. Because if I try to throw the rock while it's walking, those uh, pillars are gonna like probably bounce the rock back at me. Oh, it's wincing, but it's not dead. Take more hits. Sadly, there's no boss health meter, so there's no way for me to know how close it is to death. And there's no, like, indicator on how much health it has either. Like, is it not changing color? Oh! I think it's dead now. Big orb! Thanks for releasing me. Here, take this magic scroll and read it carefully. This spell will light the sky. It may help you on your quest. Now you must go and free the village from the evil spirits. Good luck. Oh, a scroll? So I get a new spell recipe? That can only mean that later on we'll run into areas that are going to be too dark. Lightning bolts. To create the lightning spell, you will need two diamond rings and a feather. Okay, so it could be Diamond Ring, Feather, Diamond Ring, or Diamond Ring, Diamond Ring, Feather. Do I even have enough? Oh, I only have... I have Diamond Rings, but no Feathers. That's unfortunate. Oh, by the time I realized that I, there was a chest right there, the bridge was already out. What? Did I go through that?
Amazing. There, you go into the abyss too. What? Oh man, there's like so many jumps you have one shot to do. Oh wait, I could grab it from there. Maybe you need just a running jump. Wait, how am I supposed to get up there now? Oh wait, I think I know what to do. Watch this. Oh no. Oh no! Does it go back up? Uh, I think we're in trouble. That does not reset, doesn't it? Oh, shit. This could be a problem. Okay, it does reset. I just need to go far enough. There we go. That's how you do it. You have to be encouraged to go and try to look through every nook and cranny in each stage. Which is totally insane. Like, the level of detail they put into this stage. And it looks like you have to also master being able to jump on enemies and bounce off of them. Try to steal the flying dude's helicopter. Use the action button to grab the machine. Move in any direction to fly around. Jump to leave. Wait, can I just do that now? Oh, maybe I have to kill him first. Oh, no! Come back! Oh, I messed it up. Oh, maybe it'll come back. I wanna get that. <sighs> Jump too soon. Man, it's so easy to just fuck things up in this game. It really is. Okay, I can go in the buildings. Oh, they're one way. I wonder how different it is going to be on the Sega CD. It's probably just like a better soundtrack. And maybe anime. Maybe like animated cutscenes? Yeah, I was supposed to duck. Ooh, I gotta be careful. I have no magic. Ah! God, you have, you have to be exactly in the middle. Jesus Christ. Oh, another scroll. Oh, what's this one? Oh, I'm in the wrong menu. Demon? To create the demon spell, you will need a mirror, a necklace, and a gold ring. I know that the necklace is the last ingredient. 
You just summon a freaking demon? <laughs> I like how your first spell is just like, grow plants. The next one, lightning bolts. And then the third one. Oh, you just summon a fucking demon. Why not? <laughs> Oh, it's facing the wrong way. Ah, oh, come on! The leg does not count as a hitbox, apparently. Why is it not turn around when it needs to? Oh, it got to throw the enemy right at the last moment. Okay, I guess you gotta do the level from the beginning. Well, that sucks. Okay, but I keep the scroll that I got. Oh, I got hit. What causes the chest to appear? Oh, you have to... You have to literally jump right off. Is there anything to the right of that door? Not turn on a dime. Oh my god, I still got hit because I was falling. And now I lost the copter anyway. I cannot get to that chest. It's just ungettable for me. Oh, it's just gonna tell me how to do the thing that I've been trying to do. The game is like, we want to be difficult. Okay, no secret items behind that tree. Why is the basket not the hitbox? I don't get it. Wait. Oh, that was a trampoline the whole time. I see. Oh, maybe that enemy will come back now. This will certainly get me the ring that I deserve. Jeez, just go to Bogart so you can get a diamond ring there easily. Too bad this game does not have a currency system, though, so it might be difficult. I hit the grab button too late. That one's on me. Thank you. I was about to get crushed. Not that I'm in a great situation anyway. Okay, it's just the same scroll. I kept thinking it was going to give me a different one. Like, that wouldn't make any sense. Because that was just the demon scroll.
Oh, I can't go through that side. Oh, okay, I think it just stops after a while. Oh no! It's got spikes! I just wanted to give myself a running start and thankfully it worked. God, you have to look for treasure chests in random places like you're playing- Ah! Damn it. I think you're playing like ghouls and ghosts. Why did I have to land right there? Oh, it's this idiot again. Can you get lower, please? Nope, you have to use these demons. No! No, come back! Not too late for that now. Hey there, Resurgmas. Wait. What? Maybe I can throw this in the water. Ah, oh, yes! That's what you're supposed to do to make progress. So there was a chest I probably could have gotten. Oh, that's one of the mirrors I need for the demon spell. No. You're willing to do that instead of just give me the damn mirror? What an asshole. There. He flinked it. What do I need for demon again? Okay. Maybe it's gold ring, necklace. No, no. Gold ring mirror necklace? <coughs> huh. Oh, I don't have a necklace. That must have been the item I was trying to get, but it keeps getting away. Little prick. Did it come back? No. Wait a minute. Shouldn't there be a... Shouldn't there be a platform that gets me about up there? Is it not spawning? Um... Um... I think there was supposed to be a... Oh no. I think I goofed up the area which despawned the platforms that go in and out down here, which would have allowed me to get up there. They're not showing up anymore. Oh shit. What if I go all the way to the left? Um, we have a problem. See, now the third one there showed up.
But they didn't all show up. Did you try picking up the spring? Yeah, but if I pick up the spring, then I can't go back up there. I need the spring to get up here. Yeah, you cannot pick up the spring. Also, I thought this was supposed to be a vine you can grab, but it doesn't let me grab it. What if I just do this? Okay, there we go. I had a little bit of that bridge left that I could actually go all the way to the left. Otherwise, this would have been impossible. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna do it like this. Oh no! I don't know if it'll go down the slope? Okay, no, it's not sliding down. Let's look at the demon spell again. I think I have a gold ring. Maybe it's ring mirror necklace? I mean, you can just use save states to cheat this. Let's try... Ring, mirror, necklace. Because I only have one necklace. I don't think that was the spell. Oh wait, it is! I got it right the first time. So that's what the demon looks like? He looks so happy. What? Oh, I didn't think you could pick that up from there. Oh. Ah, another key. I want to see what happens if you summon it. Oh, I don't have enough magic? magic you need to summon the demon. Oh! Okay, that'll work. that for a one-up. There we go. That's the end of the stage. I don't know how much more I'm going to be playing of this game, but at least we can get this far. Oh, not a scroller. Let me have my demon spell ready. Is Flink my name? No. Well, maybe it could be this guy's name. I don't know. 
But fun fact, I my nickname, at least one of my nicknames in high school was Clink. Oh, really? You're gonna have me do this now? Oh, that one sinks really fast. I'm trying to jump constantly so that I can stop it from sinking. Uh, I don't think I should go for that chest. Does anybody call me that anymore? Hardly. That's okay. I've been called worse. Oof, that was close. Oh, that's it! Oh, I can summon the demon now! What does it do? Oh, it just attacks the enemy right there! Get him! Oh, so it's just an attacking familiar. Oh, but it goes away after a while. Of course it does. You can't all be that for- oh, shit. Yeah! Okay. Try to cast the demon spell twice. Twice? I barely had enough MP to cast it once. Yeah, I only had enough to cast it once again. Once I'm able to get a lot of MP, I'll try to cast it cast it twice. Wait, do levels have secret exits? Hold on, there might have been a secret exit in one of the levels in the first part of the game. Hmm, doesn't look like it. Okay, so the cloud will always be right next to you, but on that side. Oh, you have a scroll. Okay, I should try to lure you as much to the left as I can. No! No, no, no! It got away! Oh man, I really could have used that spell. And it doesn't come back, unless maybe I die.
Wait a second. Oh, I think I need to keep this on screen. So that I can just use this. What do you got to tell me? There appears to be a little opening at the bottom. There must be a way to make this hole a little bit bigger so we can take a look inside. Mm. It might involve one of those spells. Wait, do I have enough to cast Demon twice? Oh, I make it bigger! And angrier. Maybe it lasts a bit longer, too. Hmm. I kind of want to go back to that level. Okay, what was the new scroll I got? Spirit Bomb? You just get a Spirit Bomb? To create the Spirit Bomb, you will need a feather, a leaf, and a gold ring. You'll need to select the feather first. Oh god. These are items from Area 1. I don't think you can get them here. Wait, can you just leave a level that you've already finished? Okay, you have to hit leave level. Oh, I bet I can go to that other path once I have the spell that opens the, the tree. Oh, but you cannot leave a level if you haven't finished it yet. Well, makes sense, I suppose. Oh! Perspective got the best of me. Alright, let's just take our time here. Oh, whoa, careful. So I think the best thing to do... I'm gonna drop the horn. I guess one of the best things you can do, especially since you need keys to open treasure chests, is if you find a level where a key is dropped, like say here, you just have to keep going back to that level over and over and get as many keys as needed. I think that might be one of the things you'll need to do in this game to have better chances throughout. You know, I don't think I remember having much of orange chicken, but it is pretty good. From what I've seen of it. Wait, that's open. But this house isn't. I'm guessing the key I got is not for the doors. Is that another catalyst item? Yeah, it was. Goblin's Tooth and Fairy Tear. Yeah, I think this game just encourages you to go back to old levels and play them over and over. 
until you have enough uh, catalyst items. This is such, like, a Mario level right now. Only without the zip lining. No! I jumped a bit too late! Oh, for fuck's sake. Just wanted another tooth. God, dealing with these guys is the worst. I say we'll probably stop the stream once we at least finish this level, because at least there's another boss. I want to see what the second boss looks like. Because the first one was batshit crazy. Oh, come on! <laughs> I, I should have waited till it was like more in the middle. Wait, can you have more than one key? Okay, it, it tallies them. That's good to know. Oh, oh my god, it's a giant walker. Okay, it throws rocks at you. Wait, how the hell are you supposed to fight it? Am I supposed to, like, throw the rocks at the top? Okay, yeah, that's what you're supposed to do. They look like Goombas in there. Oh, okay, this one's gonna take more than one hit. Oh, I was facing the wrong way. Shit. Got it. Oh, that one took way less time than the first boss. Thanks for setting me free, pal. Here, let me give you this special magic scroll. With it, you can create a spell that makes the world look bigger. Use this spell to enter the old apple tree in the village. Just the old apple tree in the... Okay. Just stand close to that little hole and cast the spell. Watch out for bugs. They bite. Okay, that's the spell I need to get into the tree. Oh, but I can go to this level. Or I can just go back. Well, I'm probably gonna end the stream soon anyway, but let's take a look at what I need for that spell. It's called Shrink. Okay, to create the Shrink spell, you will need a mirror, a necklace, and an amulet. Oh, it gives it to you right away! What's with the cloud? I don't know. It's probably something evil. Oh, but I don't have a necklace. Shit. So I wouldn't have been able to create the spell anyway. I don't remember if you get a necklace in this level. Yeah, it's not this level. Whatever. Wait. I picked up a... I think it was a ring, right? Yeah, it was a gold ring. I think if you leave the level, you keep the items you obtained. Let's see if I'm still at five.
Okay, I am still at five. So yeah, you can keep the items you obtained if you leave a level prematurely. That's good to know. So, uh, yeah. I think that's gonna be it for, uh, this game. Honestly, to tell you the truth, this game started out like you're almost fighting the game. Especially with its physics. But once you get the hang of it, especially, like, how slow you move at first, but you start accelerating automatically, when you get used to it, the game becomes a lot of fun. It seems like there's some... <clears throat> Some aspect of grinding to it, but it shouldn't be as bad. 